Hello Aries, welcome to my channel. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading and it's going to be focused on your love life. If you are new to my channel, welcome. So in this tarot card reading, I'm going to be looking at the energy of your love life. Okay, so I see a lot of interesting energies that are coming into play. The very first one is talking about expression. It feels as if for some of you, your relationship has been going through a shift. Now, another key word that is mentioned here is talking about birthing creations. I feel like in the context of this situation, your relationship with this individual has been something that, you know, it's been going through a process of evolution. It's been changing. There hasn't been that energy of solidity. There hasn't been that energy of stability, something that you may have been craving because it was still being woven. That's what I'm getting from this particular card. Now, the next card that I'm looking at is showing to me There is this guiding force over this relationship that is protective over it. There is this higher force that has brought both you and this individual together. The reason for this protection has been, you know, potentially linked or it is being linked to the idea of conflict. I feel like these are two energies that have been colliding with one another. There's a lot of similarities between both you and this person. That's why there's been all of these clashes. There's a lot of questions that are coming to light during this time. This card is talking about lifting the veil, looking more closely at a situation, trying to analyze it. So let's see. What is going on in your love life? Okay, so we have some very interesting energies that are playing out. There has indeed been some type of shift. I feel like your heart is very much open to the potential of love. There's a lot of romantic energies that you're feeling and experiencing during this time. The energies that are connecting both you and this individual are talking about heartbreak, talking about feeling like an opportunity was missed. But this doesn't feel like it's coming from your energy. This feels as if it's a mutual energy be between both you and this person concerned. Now, there's a reason for each and every of one of these cards showing up for your person. There's also an energy of great significance. I feel like this person is standing at the doorway of a new chapter in their life. I also feel as if you are standing at a new doorway in your life as well when it comes to this connection. Now, both you and this individual can go your separate ways. You can do whatever you want in this uh, relationship. However, I feel like 
the person you're dealing with is forced to conform or, you know, they're trying to make do with something that isn't satisfactory to them. And that doesn't feel as if it's connected to you. It feels as if this individual is having a hard time accepting, you know, the way that things have uh, fallen into place. You know, it feels like the energy after the dust has settled and then they take a look around and what they're left with, it's not something that they really want to be involved in. And that doesn't feel like it's your energy. It feels as if they are involved in other things in their life and it's not as satisfactory as it would be had it been with you. That's the general feeling that I'm getting from these energies. The person you're dealing with is fighting against something. I'm picking up an energy of dissatisfaction from this person, but it feels external. It doesn't feel linked to you. There could be certain things that are going on in their life where they are being forced to accept things as they are, things of that nature, and it feels as if they're trying to fight against that. Both you and this individual are at the precipice of this new chapter in your life. You know, you can go in the direction of a new love, this individual can go in the direction of something that catches their fancy, any sort of thing. It's very interesting that the universe has brought up these type of energies at this moment in time. Yeah. I do feel like there's this energy of disappointment because this energy never ground as much as it could have for both you and this person concerned. Some of you may have plans of the future, you know, going out, finding love. This individual is struggling to accept things as they are. This person doesn't know if you are going to be a part of their life. Let's have a look and see things from a different perspective. Okay, so I'm seeing some very interesting energy show up here. It feels as if both you and this individual have went off on your own journey, you know, journey of exploration. There's been a lot of chances that have been taken. There's been a lot of risk in this relationship. It could be, you know, the reason why so many of you were feeling, you know, very thrilled to have this connection with this individual, because it feels as if it was a journey into the unknown you know, there was that element of unpredictability and with unpredictability comes a bit of danger. So I see that in this situation, there is this element of looking at each other, having that connection, having that realization. But then there is this mess that happened between both you and this person. You know, there might have been a lack of honesty, a lack of clarity, a lack of uh, being open to each other. This is a card of, you know, someone that sees you, recognizes you, and establishes that they are thinking about you a lot. They're trying to, you know, assimilate all of their feelings and put it into words, but it almost feels as if because this figure's uh, face is just showing a blank look, that all they can do is watch, all they can do is uh, look at a situation and not fully participate. Now, at some point in time, this happened between you and this person. I feel like this person had a great deal of admiration for you. Some of you may have been in a relationship with this individual. For others, it might have been so complicated, you really didn't know what to make of it. Now, with this card, I feel like there was a lack of honesty about your feelings and their feelings towards each other. Somewhere along the line, this sort of confusion came into play. 
This card is showing to me that this person may have been highly entertained by you, Aries. It feels as if they really enjoyed this energy, this, uh, you know, sort of connection that the two of you shared with each other. It feels as if it used to make their day. And I feel like they still look at it in that way. They still think about those times. Someone really didn't follow their heart in this situation. As amazing as it was, someone really ignored their heart. There might have been things that were said and done for some of you that should not have been said or done. Yeah, I feel like there's an energy of this person for a small handful of you, it could be that this individual was never really there when you really needed them. They might have thought that the world revolved around them. For some of you, they could have been emotionally detached. This could be a male or female. But it feels as if, you know, you brought them a lot of joy, but they never fully participated in a way that you expected them to. Someone in this situation is definitely, you know, looking around and wondering, you know, what's next, what's going to happen in the situation. I feel like this could be you or this could be this individual that you're dealing with. It really is not showing at this moment in time. So I'm going to be exploring the balance of these energies on an extended reading. I'm going to be looking very closely at the energy of this individual. How are they perceiving the situation? What are, you know, their thoughts, their feelings, their mind, heart and soul energy? What is going to be happening in respect of this connection? How should you move things along, etc. I hope you guys have enjoyed your reading. Have a wonderful day and take care.